Hey everyone, I'm Kenneth. Thank you for joining me. And today we are going to be indulging in two indie horror games. The first one is Just Stopping By, made by 1AM Train. You and a friend are on a road trip in a foreign country. You make a pit stop for snacks and a bathroom break, then it's back on the road again. Maybe. Alright, well let's... What are you doing? Jody. Jody. Good evening, Sleeping Beauty. You really slept through the whole ride, huh? I was getting hungry, so I decided to make a little stop here and buy some chips, even though this place looks shady AF. Hey, I heard you talking in your sleep. Didn't sound nice. Want to talk about it? Nah? Alright, well, if you need to piss, I can wait for you. Such a lady. I'm just gonna go at, go at the hotel. Public restrooms are nasty. Don't take too long. Do it, and off we go. Germany looked better on the postcards. Oh! Just a huge slam against Germany out of nowhere. You're gonna talk about Germany when your face looks like that? Our car. Okay. Gast and Rast. Alright. This door is closed and I think I should go and ask for a key. Let's do it. We're just going to leave Jody to her Tai Chi. Ooh. Missing. Jonas Mueller. Okay. Trash can. I see no smoking, no drinking, no animals. What? I am here. Wow, you guys love your ketchup. <laughs> hmm. You got a really nice flat store, sir. Clerk. Hello. I'm, I'm assuming welcome to Gast and... Oh, my bad. We're not used to customers that aren't from around here. Actually, we had one just now. Perhaps you are with that blonde lady? Anyways, how can I help you? You need to use the restroom? You're really brave. <laughs> I think it's disgusting. It gets cleaned like once a week. Well, can you not clean it more often? You're the cl Okay, whatever. Please make sure to not lose the keys. The last guy who took them didn't bring them back. Here, take them. Okay. I don't, I don't, why, why am I not just going with Jody to the uh, hotel <laughs> bathroom? <laughs> Is that blood? Awesome. All right, I guess let's uh, go to the bathroom, toilet. Oh, Lord. Oh, wow, we survived. I mean, it doesn't look that bad aside from the... Oh, I didn't close the door behind me. That's not good. I can't... Wa oh, well, there's no faucet. So, no, I can't wash my hands. All right. Hi, Jody. I lit... You... Where am I? Um, it looks like the back rooms. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Man, these back rooms just pop up everywhere, don't they? I don't know. I try to like to to stay on the oh god on the far walls. Ooh. I want to know who chose the wallpaper for the back rooms because it's hideous. I hate it. It. Oh, God. Are you going to suck me into a dark void? Mm. Question mark? Something fell out of it. Oh, God. It's a blue crystal? I wonder what I can do with this. Uh, can we back up? Okay. 
We have fun. Um, it's not like coming after me, is it? No, it just seems to be rotating. Okay, I. Mm. <laughs> Okay, do I have like an inventory? I do, oh my god, I have an inventory. Yeah, we, boy, we sure do have a blue crystal. Okay. You just, you're constantly waiting for something to be around a corner. I have no run, so I'm gonna assume nothing's gonna like come after us. Oh god. There is something, and agree with me or not, something really unnerving and unsettling about just like black voids <laughs> like this. Like, I think that's why, like, in 2001 and 2010, the monoliths freaked me out so much. I mean, you just, it's... Ugh. A red crystal dropped on the ground. Okay. Um, thanks. Please don't come after me. Mm-hmm. Get an interior designer. Oh. Okay. This is the third crystal dropping out of these structures. A green one. I feel observed. Oh, God. I don't want to be observed. Can we go? They all sound like they're making different noises, too. Stay on the outer edges. Oh, hi. Well, there's, I mean, there's only three, so I guess. What? Oh! Hi? Oh, door, door, door. I have no run. No, don't get me. Don't get me. <laughs> what is that thing? <laughs> the bathroom keys I got earlier fit in this keyhole. Well, use it, girl! What? Uh, uh. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Weird. Well, we've got like a black pillar and we've got like a really nice sky looking pillar. Let's go to the, the nice looking one. I wonder what would happen if I go through that door again. Okay. Did I win? Lightness, comfort, peace. You will ascend. <laughs> okay. Thank you for participating. In what? Uh, okay. I just take my sweet ass time. All right. What is the uh I ascended last time, so what happens if we choose the oh so inviting? pitch black inky void pillar darkness sorrow agony you will descend thank you for participating Oh, you can't. Oh. Uh, is there another ending? Is it just these two options? I was hoping I could go back through this door and start a new life with whatever that thing was. You know? Well, I think we can all agree that this is a cautionary tale. Um never use public restrooms in Germany.
I think that's something we can all get behind. I, we could go a step further and say, just don't use public restrooms. You know, you could end up in the back rooms. So yes, just stopping by. I, uh, I'll leave a link to it down in the description box below. Let's move on to the next one. Here we go. Hey, all right. Next one is No Way Out. This is by Dark XK105. This is a short horror game that focuses on atmosphere. You must find a way out, but who knows if you'll survive what's at the end. Uh, and this is their first game. So with an emphasis on a uh, on atmosphere, I say let's let's go. Let's see. Oh dear. Do I have a flashlight? Oh, wait. oh God. Yeah, I have a flashlight. And so I just fell down like an idiot. Okay, let's let's go into this not creepy red hallway. Here we go. Almost looks invisible, like oh, okay. Oh, the the red disappeared. What? Okay. No. Okay. Oh, do you have a run? Yeah, I'm okay, there we go. Do I have clogs on? Oh, hello, door. Ooh. ooh. Press E to interact with objects. Ooh. Part of the shelf is covered in what appears to be blood. I wonder what happened here. Nothing good. I, I feel confident in saying that. Same thing. Part of the shelf is covered in what appears to be blood. Okay. Get it. Just a bunch of boxes. Nothing interesting. I'm sure somebody finds boxes interesting. Is that just graffiti? Oh, God. Okay. Uh, it won't open. Shucks. <laughs> yes. I'm sure I've heard someone knocking on this door. It won't open, though. That's a damn shame, you know? I was really hoping to invite somebody in. There's no way I can get through. There's a fence blocking the way. Well, you're not trying hard enough, buddy. Like, your ass is on the line, I think. I Figure it out. Ugh. There's something, like... Just immediately, like, stomach drops. Any more blood on the shelves? No, but what is that? Is that a key? Key acquired. Shelf is covering that door. I hope this key is useful. Press one to use keys. Oh. The lock is broken. Okay, so a key's not gonna fix a broken lock. Can I get to this door? It's locked. Okay, so... It's unlocked now. Fantastic. Look at us knowing how to play games. Oh, crowbar. Crowbar acquired. They don't seem to work. All of these papers look like reports of some kind. I don't think there's anything interesting. All right. So use the crowbar perhaps on this door with the broken lock. Just waiting for some, wait, there we go. Uh, two, nice. That should do it. Oh God.
I can't get through. Entry is forbidden, personnel only, restricted area. It won't open. I, I keep expecting something to come up behind me or see something out of the corner of my eye. So uh, this dev saying they wanted to uh, work on atmosphere. I I think you, you kind of got it. Can I interact with anything? Yeah, I keep wanting to look over my shoulder, but I keep not wanting to look over my shoulder too. <laughs> like footsteps before I even moved. Oh no! Oh, we don't have a flashlight. What is this? I should grab that lighter. Yeah, by the blood. Let's do that. Okay. Uh, I'm just gonna head in the direction of like light. That sounds like there's somebody coming behind us. I don't like it. <laughs> eh. Just I'm following the the pin pricks of light. Stop it. Yeah, that that's not us. Oh god. Oh, I've lost Oh, there's a door. Five, eight, six, three. Yeah, there's something here with us, dude. I don't. I okay, guess where we came from. Ah. Uh, five, eight, six, three. Let me in. to step on this. <sighs> Note archive found you. Oh god. Hey, what found me? Oh, it's just blood everywhere. Just blood. Everywhere. Oh, I can't move. I can't move, like, at all. <sighs> yeah, come and eat me. What, what are you? Am I surrounded? Y 
You're awfully tall. You're awfully tall. And fade into oblivion. Well, that was no way out. Uh, again, this was the first game by this dev. Um, the focus was atmosphere. I think he did a pretty damn good job of it. Like I said, I kept feeling like I wanted to constantly look over my shoulder. That last section sounded like somebody was behind us, running up behind us. It sounded like there were more than just our footsteps. Um, I think he did a pretty good job of, of building tension and suspense. Um, again, I think a lot of it can be linked to the uh, the sound designs. Although having that kind of narrow uh, vision because of the s the screen resolution, I think that helped too. Um, but yeah, for for a first outing for an indie dev, I think I think you did a, a darn fine job. All right, gang, that was that was no way out. We also played just stopping by. Again, I will leave a link to both games down in the description box below. Let me know what you think of the games down in the comments or just pop in to say hi. I like hearing from you. If you liked this video, do think about leaving a like for the video. I certainly appreciate it. Think about subscribing. I love you as part of the channel and you can share the video. Um, I, am, I am cool with all of that. So that's what I have for you on this Thursday. I will plan to see you Saturday for more Ghosts of Tsushima. So until then, you all take care. Have a fantastic Thursday. Bye!